was a crazy stand. So the spot looked super good, so I stopped and waited. I called for a longer time. Um, I had some coyotes off to the left howling at me, but this right side looked super good in about 23 minutes or so. A pack of four came in and they were on a rope, just sprinting right to me. Um, two of them checked up at like um, 100 yards, maybe. Just that ridge right there. Um, the other one came right into the decoy. Um, there's Raya. But the other one stopped just over this hill. Gave me enough time to get the camera, move it, try to get it figured out on him. Just as he was about to move, I was able to pull the trigger on him and knock him down. We'll see what Raya does. Where is it? Get it. Where is it? Good girl. What we got? Get it. Good girl. The blood dog is the second dog Raya's been on. She's a little bit nervous of him. Shot was a little back, but did the trick. Come here. So after I shot this one, I turned it pup in distress and one came back up on the top of that hill and it's a little bit of a shot, but I took a shot and looking at the video, it looks like I might have grazed its back, went up over the hill. So I'm going to get this one and then uh, go hike up that hill and see if we can't see that other one, but good spot. All right. Good girl. Yeah, good girl. Good girl, what you got? Good girl. Yeah, what is it? Good girl. Good girl. <laughs> oh. This is my uh, fourth stand of the morning. 
set up and it just looked super good so I was going to give it a lot of time. Um, went through two or three different calls. Um, the third one finally worked out. Right near the beginning I had a bunch um, off to that way howling at me so I thought maybe they'd come in from that way but this whole valley looks super good. And then in about 20 minutes or so a pack of four dogs come whipping around this, this corner and they were on a rope. They just came. Um, they checked up at about Man, 100 yards, two of them did on the hill looking at me. I'm fumbling with the camera. One kept coming right under the call. Um, I was able to get on him right before he started to move. I shot and was able to, to drop this dude. Um, I turned the pup in distress on quick. And another one came up on this hill um, just to check it out. Pretty far shot. I took a shot. It looks like I may have hit him, so I'm going to have to walk up there and just check it out. Um, but super, super cool, cool area, cool drainage, new, new spot. First time I've ever been here. Um, and it was, it was awesome. Paid off. This guy's a nice dog. It's a male, um, pack of four coming in. That's hard to do trying to self film and shooting on your own. I needed a, needed a few more shooters with me. Uh, maybe could have had one more, but that was fun. Good little stand. Uh, hiked up and over the mountain and saw the tracks, snow blood, followed the tracks down to the bottom here. And he kept going, so I must have missed or not been a lethal hit. And he's gone, gone, gone. So there are a ton of tracks over here. I think they were living over on this side. I heard my call got curious enough they wrapped around the bottom of this and came in so ended up being good just one pup Well, that one was kind of, man, it came in weird. I had to set up the tripod a little higher to get him over the ridge. And then I had him in frame, but he freaking moved. But I was able to howl him and stop him. But he was just out of camera frame. But the shot was pretty dang good. It was a pretty far shot, but he just crumpled. Another one down. This one's a female. Last one was a male. Good looking doggy. I just wrapped around the mountain where I called those four in. Um, I could still hear them yelling, so I came across, drove around, hiked back up the other side, and I topped out and I scared one out. So I thought I'd just set up right there and see what happens. I could steer, feel, hear some down the valley. So I set up and that one never came back, but right at about 20 minutes, this one came in from the right, um, just to where I could barely see him. I jacked up the tripod a little bit, got him on there, but he, she just walked out of frame when I shot. I had to, you know, bark her to get her to stop, but <clears throat> it's been a good day. I had one on the very first stand, nothing on the second or third. I had that four pack of four come in on the fifth stand, and then this guy on the sixth stand. So it's been pretty dang productive day so far. It's a nice, nice coat. This one's a female. The last one I got was a male, but <clears throat> been fun exploring new 
new territory does does have its perks. 